Scorpio, let's rock. Okay, this is obviously wanting to take a swipe. Okay, wanting to show someone what's up. Okay. Let's see what other characters may want to come out here. Okay, this is depth here. To me, this is depth. This is like a wellspring of emotion. It's almost as if someone wants to challenge um, what they can't see <clears throat> or what they don't know. You know? It's like they're swiping at the top of the glacier, but 90% of you is below the surface. You know, and that's that's a lot of everyone with every, you know, everything and everybody. Um, sorry, I don't mean, <laughs> I don't mean to be like such chill dad vibe, but, um, <laughs> the Empress. Um, I've more recently started interpreting that scepter as a cellular, cellular device or some sort of communication device. Um, like on, on some like, uh, Tartarian ancient, uh, technology stuff. Um, I'm sure there's some sort of symbolism between those, um, fixtures behind what she's resting on. Um, so you could think about that and interpret that. Obviously, you have the river of what's flowing. To me, this is connected to the Five of Cups um, card because there, that also features a flowing river. And so that flowing river, when you let go, that leads you to grace. That leads you to opulence, abundance. Okay, everything that the Empress is about. You know she smells good. All right. So... To me, in tandem, in context, this is all about being unfettered, okay? Unbothered. Ooh, unbothered. <laughs> Here we go. Just channeling that kind of grace, that opulence, that just unbothered. Oh, damn. That really, that was a nail in the coffin for, <clears throat> for you. Um... So cool, I feel good about this. I really don't got anything negative to say here. This is definitely the hangman in reverse is co-signing. This is seeing things differently. This is enlightenment. I'll leave it there, holler for more.